All right, uh, welcome to my lightning talk. Uh, I'm Shwai Lamba. I'm a contributor and meshmate at Layer 5. And the topic of my lightning talk is a meshmate, a new way of expanding open source uh, community mentorship. So um, a lot of us have seen these kind of issues, right? That uh, if you have thought about ever contributing to the CNCF, which is the Cloud Native Computing Foundation, um, you might have come across this particular uh, diagram, which sort of shows the entire landscape or the ecosystem for the CNCF. And it can be really difficult for someone who is as a beginner to go through it. And sometimes even when I actually saw this landscape, my mind was completely blown because of the sheer number of projects that are there uh, it's like you know, having the landscape from uh, databases to all the way working with Kubernetes. Uh, so, of course, I mean, CNC is just one of those uh, open source uh, projects that are out there. But of course, uh, these kind of issues with respect to uh, the fear that someone might have when it actually comes uh, to contributing to open source, especially someone who is a beginner, they lie abundantly across the vast spectrum of the different open source projects that today exist uh, amongst us. So uh, some of the common struggles that uh, a beginner, especially who is just getting started in their open source journey, uh, often like you know feels uh, really um, insecure or they feel really shy to ask questions uh, to uh, the uh, maintainers or to the audience of that particular open source project that they want to contribute to because they are, uh, they feel very uh, uncomfortable in asking uh, the questions and sometimes they can be very intimidated by the large code bases that might be there uh, they might actually get imposter syndrome uh, from seeing a lot of the other active contributors. And sometimes, of course, they might get confused where should they actually contribute to because they don't have that appropriate uh, knowledge about the uh, ecosystem, especially if you're looking at a large ecosystem like, let's say, the Cloud Native, the CNCF ecosystem. So in order to uh, overcome some of these struggles that beginners usually uh, like, you know, uh, face, especially uh, like, you know, students or uh, folks who are early into their tech journey, uh, that's where uh, the Layer 5 community, uh, which is a community uh, mainly for service meshes, so it's part of the CNCF. A number of different projects that have been born and brought up by the Layer 5 community currently are incubated in the uh, CNCF, which is the Cloud Native Computing Foundation. So we came up with this uh, program known as the MeshMates program. And the main idea behind this MeshMates program is uh, to empower these uh, students or these newcomers into technology who have just ventured or have sort of stepped into the cloud native space to feel secure and to actually feel welcomed into these communities. So uh, what meshmates are, meshmates are some of these regular and uh, like, you know, some of the uh, core members of uh, the layer five community who have had the experience of actually being contributing to some of the projects and they have actually stayed in the community for long and they have been actively helping others in the community. So uh, what the meshmates do is that they sort of uh, pair up with these newcomers who are in, uh, coming in the first time, for the first time in, in the Layer 5 community and they provide them one-to-one -one mentorship. And they provide this personalized mentorship uh, to these students or to these newcomers uh, to sort of help them explore the vast uh, CNCF landscape. And that's not just limited to actually the CNCF landscape. If a newcomer has no idea about open source in general, uh, let's say uh, with respect to Git, GitHub, so they will actually give them, provide them that one-to-one -one mentorship uh, with respect to Git GitHub, with respect to the CNCF landscape, uh, with respect to all the projects that are actually there inside the layer five and out, uh, outside the layer five as well. And this will sort of help um, make the students or the newcomers feel much more welcomed because generally that's one of the biggest like you know problems that we see that they are not just very willing to open up because they are a little insecure or they are feeling scared to ask questions. But by providing this one-to-one -one mentorship, they feel a lot more welcomed and um, essentially that's what like you know the major objective of this program is to make open source uh, uh, representation uh, and like you know whosoever is joining respective irrespective of their uh, like you know uh, status uh, they feel welcomed into this open source uh, program so in order to actually become meshmate uh, you can actually join the weekly newcomers meetings that takes place on every Thursday and uh, you can also follow the community handbook that sort of covers how you can actually get started by becoming a part of the layer 5 community and you can also get an overview of all the different uh, open source projects that are actually there right now and then you are sort of like you know are paired with this uh, mesh mate uh, to uh, provide you the one-to-one -one mentorship and again uh, the idea is that uh, you are guided not only in terms of the projects themselves but also 
the mesh mates they help you shape your career by understanding what are your interest and then sort of helping you make your first ever pull request and first ever open source contribution so that you become more confident and more uh, competent in actually being able to make open source contributions especially in the uh, uh, the cloud native landscape and of course uh, the more you contribute then you can jump on the contributor contribution ladder and that's why the layer 5 community is actually one of the most well sought after communities especially for students and for early beginners uh, there are more than 700 plus contributors right now across various projects and uh, there are maintainers from multiple con uh, multiple countries uh, companies uh, that are part of this ecosystem and uh, that actually also super proud to share that uh, the uh, basically under the linux foundation mentorship that is a lfx mentorship program which is a program uh, meant for uh, uh, college students uh, to take part in various open source projects. Uh, the layer 5 uh, projects uh, including the mesh tree project was actually rated the number one project and that's mainly again because of the driving factor that each and every member who joins irrespective of their experience are um, like you know are always welcomed with open hands to actually come and join the community and they are given this one to one post sites mentorship now of course uh, this you may ask like you know uh, of course for larger organizations which have like let's say tens of thousands of members is uh, like you know being able to provide one to one mentorship is it feasible so it, of course it might not be feasible but the general idea that i want to represent through this program is that open source really is open for everyone right generally we speak about diversity in uh, open source or uh, diversity in technology but diversity and inclusivity are two different uh, things right and we have to ensure that each and every person who joins an open source community feels uh, like you know uh, feel secure and they feel inclusive uh, inclusive of the community and inclusiveness also comes from the fact that they are able to truly understand the core uh, values of the open source uh, organization and also of course uh, with respect to the code as well so that's why uh, in order to make others feel inclusive uh, we can actually create uh, programs like this meshmate program to make everyone feel welcomed and of course uh, meshmate is just one of these programs that showcases that if you provide value to the community and if you feel if you make your newcomers feel welcomed in the program then they are there they're going to be there for the long run and they're going to be happy and that's one of the greatest ways to measure the success of an uh, open source community and of course in communities in general uh but yeah with that in mind uh, thank you so much for attending this lightning talk um uh, i if you want to connect with me you can connect with me on uh, my twitter at the @howdevelop and if you want to start your cloud native journey you can uh, join uh, the uh, layer 5 community by going to layer5.io/community uh, thank you so much